What's up, freaks? It's Steve from Peak Physique Personal Training Bootcamp and Boxing. We're gonna get rolling here in just a second with a live follow-along boxing cardio core training session. A full training session available for you to follow along. I know you're sitting at home, you're cramped up, you're, you're frustrated, you're pissed off. This is a perfect chance to, to release some stress, to burn off some anxiety, to kill some freaking fat, and to keep your metabolism boosting rather than just sitting on the couch, sitting dark and lonely and depressed and all this other bullshit. This is exactly the time that you need to stand the hell up, to step up, to pick up the pace. This is not the time to start going backwards, not the time to start retracting. This is the time to move forward and attack the fucking hills in your life, attack adversity. So if, whether you don't need any equipment here for this at all, not even gloves, you could do it straight in the air. If you happen to have gloves or a heavy bag, I'm gonna give you a couple seconds while we get warmed up here to get set up on your bag if you want. If you wanna follow along with us, this will be recorded and we will keep this posted up for you to use later on if you're not able to follow along as we're doing it. If you have a bag, we have a bag here. They're gonna be demonstrating this stuff on a bag. I'll be demonstrating it in the air. I'm gonna stay attached to the mic as much as possible. Sometimes I'll need to step back to show you some footwork stuff, so I'll take come out from the mic. You won't be able to hear me as well, but that's, that's fine because it is a wired mic. So get yourself set up. We're gonna go through a full entire training session from warm up to stretching to actually attacking punching, kicking, cardio, core, all straight through. Follow along if you can. I'm going to give you a second to get set up here. And just to remind you that as you're, you're hunkered down, whatever the hell's going on with this crazy, this corona bullshit, that's what we call this. This is the corona project. We're going to overcome this shit. We're going to defeat it. We're going to crush it. We're going to come out on the other end better, stronger, faster, mentally stronger, physically stronger and in better shape. We're going to still continue on our weight loss, on our physical health and fitness nutrition journey. This is a time to have laser beam focus on your nutrition. This is the time to be have even more discipline in all areas of your life. This is not the time to start slacking off. This is the time to start growing your business, not start worrying about how it's going to affect you. It's going to affect everyone. It's affecting all of us, but this is the time to step up, the time to move forward. So we're going to get started with a basic warm-up, real simple, just going through some basic punches, basic stretches to get you rolling. If you've never boxed before, this is perfect. You can never get too much practice. Sandrina, what's up? I'm going to try and also keep track. If you have any questions, comments, put them down there below as we're, as we're rolling through this. But if you've never boxed before, we're always going to go through the basics, the techniques, the warm-ups, get you warmed up, get your blood flowing, your upper body, your lower body. We're going to go through it all. So even if you've done been boxing with us at peak for years, you can never get too much practice. You can never get too much warm up. You can never throw too many punches to get them, get them sharper and continuing to freaking sharpen the, 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 the saw, whatever. Keep it, keep, it, keep it going. Keeping your skills sharp, keeping it fresh, keep moving forward, keep getting better, keep practicing, rehearsing, and that's exactly, exactly what we're going to do. So we're going to get started. Real simple. While, while we're doing this, Tyson, go back in, in the brick spot. We're gonna go with forward shoulder circles while you're just moving your feet in place. You're just stepping forward, stepping back, just getting loosened up. We're gonna go from the beginning, loosening you up, getting you ready to punch some shit. If you have something to punch, punch it. If you don't, that's fine. You're gonna go in the air just with me. I'm gonna do the air version, they're gonna be doing the, the heavy bag version. If you don't have a heavy bag, they're gonna keep doing that while they're moving their feet back there. While they're moving their feet back there. Forward circles. Let's switch that to backward circles and keep moving your feet. So if I st I'm gonna stop sometimes just to give you some instructions, some direction, but if you need something to punch, find something in your house to punch. When I was a kid, I told this story somewhere today. When I was a kid, I didn't have a heavy bag. I wanted to punch stuff, and I had a lot of anger, was pissed off a lot. I took my pissy mattress. Yes, I used to wet the bed when I was a kid. I wet the bed, I think, until second or third grade, I think. I don't know wh why or how. Pretty late. I was still pissing the damn bed. So I took my pissy mattress, and it was all nasty and screwed up, had literally springs sticking out of it because of the mattress that was, I don't know, 30 years freaking old. So I took the pissy mattress, put it on the corner of where the door was, like the door frame, wrapped it around it, and started taping it, tying it down, doing what I had to do. And I used that as my heavy bag when I was a kid, punching it. So there's always a way to uh, figure shit out. So don't make excuses. Start making shit happen. All right, we're going in and out with our shoulders, right on my top, right on my bottom. Just fling it open while you're still moving the feet. Just stepping side to side, moving forward moving backwards, getting the blood flowing, loosen up the shoulders. If you have any questions, comments, put them below. I'll be, I'll be keeping an eye on the comments down there. Now fling it, catch it for a stretch. Hold it for one to three seconds. Fling it open, catch it on the other side. Fling it, hold and stretch. 
while your feet are still moving. You can see I'm moving back and forth. That's not just because I have problems staying still. Well, I do have problems staying still, but that's because I'm actually trying to just get the legs started moving. Speaking of the legs, we're going to get now just quad stretch. We're going to alternate a quad stretch. If you can't see me, because I'm, I'm mic'd up here, so you might not be able to see me. I'm going quad stretch for one to three seconds, the other side one to three seconds, then knee hug and knee hug. You're going to rotate through that on your own. So quad, quad, knee hug, knee hug. Hold them each for one to three seconds, however you feel like you need to. At the same time that you're getting that stretch, you're working on the other side, getting that balance ready. Because when you're throwing kicks, you're only on one leg. So at the same time, we're warming up your balance. So just quad stretch, quad stretch, knee hug, knee hug. And you can see these freaks in the background doing it to get a, be a different view if you're, if you're cut off on the bottom of my screen. Quad, quad, knee, knee. Also realize where we're doing this workout. Let's get a little bounce to your step. Little bounce to your step. Shake those arms out. Shake it out. Loose. Get some blood flowing. As I'm saying stuff here, Facebook, if you know, they flip, they mirror the screen when you're seeing it live. So if you see this, you probably see it backwards, right? The, the peak physique. That's not because we're backwards and we're screwed up. We are backwards and screwed up, but that's because that's how Facebook does it on the live. So if I'm saying left, do your left. Even though this looks like my right, that is my left. So if I say left, do left. So as you're looking at the screen, picture this as a mirror. So although this looks my, like my left, if you were facing me, it would look like it would be your right. So keep that in mind. It's the opposite to do what I'm saying, not what you think that you're seeing. The techniques will be the same. So let's loosen up a little more with those punches. Let's get in your stance, your basic stance. If, I, if I'm too close and you can't see my feet, your left leg is forward, your right leg is back. You're on the balls of your feet, a little balance of your step. Your hands are up. People say put your hands on your chin. You don't want them at your chin because look, then my face is exposed. You want them up high, up by your cheekbones, peeking up. Your chin is tucked. You're peeking through your eyelids. Elbows in tight. You don't want your elbows out in the A-frame. In tight, protecting your ribs. A little rounded forward right here. A little bounce to your step. So let's just get that stance down first. Light on your feet. We're going to go with this our one, our basic one, simple stuff, which is our who, our left jab, our one. <laughs> Breathe it out. So your palm starts facing in, ends up facing the ground, snaps back in. Snap it and right back in. in. It's a straight line. Pin is shoulder. Like I'm snapping a corkscrew. You can see my palm at your own pace. If you need to, just go nice and slow to get it. Whatever hand's punching, you can see this opposite hand is glued to my chin, protecting us. Listen, you need to keep your hands up. Some of us can't afford to take any more damage to our ugly mugs, so keep that hand up, whatever's not punching. And you can see my chin is tucked in here, so I'm pretty well doing that jab. And you can see these two back here, they're gonna go, go at your own speed. If you know what you're doing, just snap it out there. But I want some footwork, some rhythm, some bounce to your step. Get some rhythm. Every one of you has some rhythm. Well, maybe every one of you, but most of you have some rhythm. Light on your feet, <laughs> breathe it out. Straight, that's your one. Your one jab, snap, right back in. To your, to, to your guard, protecting that ugly mug. Boom, let's go with our two. That's our straight right. If you can't see my feet because I'm too close, look at the freaks behind me. Two is your straight right. You're turning your hip, pivoting your right foot. Same thing. You can see it turns. My body is throwing the punch. The power is coming from the ground up, from my legs. So boom, turn your hips, snap it right back in. Light on your feet, the story two. <sighs> Breathe. When you're moving around, you don't have a bag. You should be bouncing around all over the place. Bam. Snap, snap it, accelerate it, return it back to home. And just pop, breathe. <sighs> Sometimes if my position, I might be out of position on punching, so I'm looking at you, trying to see them, see if making sure I'm on the screen. But just snap, bam, that two, that's your two. Put those two together now, your one, two. <sighs> and you should be going full speed, bouncing in your step, <sighs> right down the middle. Light on your feet, boom, boom. Extend, so even though we're punching air, you're going full speed. You need to get your blood flowing, get your heart rate up, get your body temperature up. So just because you're punching air doesn't mean you just go through the motions with some bullshit like this. The whole purpose of shadow boxing is to get used to throwing full speed punches while maintaining your balance and missing. Because listen, when you're out there and the, the end of the world is coming and the invasion is coming, you're gonna miss a lot of those punches in the chaos. You need to be used to, boom, missing a full speed punch and still maintaining your balance maintaining your guard. Otherwise, if you're only used to hitting full speed punches on a bag and half-assing it in the air, when you miss a full speed sponge, a full speed punch in the air, you're going to be here and you're going to be off balance and fall forward and you're going to be screwed. So get that balance. <laughs> One, two. Bounce around. <laughs> full speed. Light on your feet. Flow. Turn. Pivot. Move. Boom. boom. 
Make sure you're turning that right hip on the two. Right down the middle. Let's get those legs warmed up. We're gonna go jacks only with your feet. If you can't see my feet, look at the freaks behind me. Bouncing your step. Hands are staying in the guard. We're mixing up boxing with our cardio. Hands in your guard. If I'm here, that's just because I'm holding the wire so I don't snap you down. So get those hands up, up tight. Balancing your step. You could see them here, the way their feet are going apart and together just on the balls of your feet. Bouncing your step, flowing, hands up tight. Keep those feet going. Bounce, bounce, abs are strong. Every set is an ab set. Abs are strong every second of every exercise. Keep breathing, getting that blood flowing. Let's go to our threes and fours. Three is your left hook. Four is your right hook. Your elbow's bent 90 degrees. It's moving parallel to the floor. So let's just go three, four, right off the bat. Your left hook, right hook. Right off the bat, hook, hips, hips, your feet. Look at their hips back there, pivoting. Body's turning like a door swinging on a hinge. That's why you need to think about swinging on these hooks. Light on your feet. Turn those hips. Move around, move around, get some flow, get your legs working. Bounce around, some energy, some flow. Three, four. Move, work. If you're not getting your heart rate up, you're not getting your body temperature up, you're not moving fast enough. Just punch in the air, just shadow boxing. You should be elevating your heart rate. You should already be getting hot and sweaty just from beating the shit out of the air. That's what you need to be thinking. Get that aggression out, even on the air. Three, four. All right, let's go to our feet. We're gonna go split jacks. Legs only, hands up. Feet go front to back. If you could see, if I could back up, let them go sideways so they can see your feet. So you see their feet are just shuffling front and back. In place, split jack. Hands in the guard the whole time. Feet bouncing front to back on the balls of your feet. Still just getting those feet, calves, legs warmed up, getting your freaking blood flowing, getting ready to rock. That's all we're doing here. Bouncing your step. All right, let's go to uppercuts. Uppercuts, five and six. Five is your left uppercut. Six is your right uppercut. Think of your body turning. Your legs and body, your, your lats, obliques, are what's throwing these punches. Five, six. Five is the left upper, six is the right upper. Think about landing right underneath a chin. Or if it's to the body, bang, right into the gut. Whatever hand's not punching again, don't forget. Stays glued to your freaking chin. Five, six. Right there. Short, choppy, bam, bam. These are close range punches. Move around while you're doing this. Light on your freaking feet. Boom, boom, twist, crunch, crunch into it. It's all over the place. You should be all over the place here. Even when you're not punching, you're moving. Stop, bam, bam, get the work done, get out. Damage, and move. Get your heart rate up, even though you're just punching the air. Get work in, breathe. Breathe for each strike. Light on your feet. We're just getting the blood flowing. We're gonna go crisscross with our feet. Wide, right leg in front. Wide, left leg in front. You can watch their feet as they're going. Tice, come a little forward. You can see, come forward. Right there, turn towards me. You can see he's going right leg in front. That's your new spot, in the middle. Right there, right there, right there. Right there, right there. Right leg in front, left leg in front. You can see he's bouncing his step with his hands up in the guard, of course. You would hate to see you take any punches if your hands aren't up. Keep those hands up. Us ugly fools, we cannot take any more damage to this face, to these face. So I'll bounce in your step, hands up in the guard. Let's loosen up those hips and hamstrings a little more. We're just gonna go with front kicks. Just bend and extend. Hands are up, bend and extend. Front kick, loosening up. We're gonna kick with the back leg. So you're gonna switch your stance. You can see them doing back there. From a side view, kicking with the back leg, switching the stance. From a side view, from a side view, how about that? <laughs> hands up, hands up. So you can see he's switching his stance, boom, and kick. So you're kicking with the back leg. He's always switching to get his back leg kicking. Bend the knee and extend, driving it forward. Switch, hands are up. Switch, just loosening up. Bend and extend, get that foot up in front of your face. Get those hips into it. Breathe it out, just getting your whole body moving. All right, we're gonna get a little shuffle side to side. Whatever space you have, you're gonna get a little shuffle. You're gonna go two ones on the left side, 
two twos on the right side. So over here, that's gonna be two ones. Right here, I'm gonna shuffle across whatever space you have, get in my stance, and two twos. You have more space, I'm going a real short distance because of the camera. Go whatever space you have in your house, the park, wherever the hell you are, knock some shit over, break some stuff, put some holes in the walls, whatever it is. You're gonna shuffle side across and shuffle across fast and two, two. Shuffle across with your hands up, get in your stance, one, one. Shuffle across, get in your stance, two, two. High energy here, we need high energy. I'm already sweating underneath this sweatshirt. So you should be also, shuffle across, pop. Quick, 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 make this quick. Put in some intensity, put in some speed into this shit. Don't half-ass this. Shuffle it across. Boom, boom. Right down the middle. Pop, pop, pop it over. Boom, boom. Shuffle it. Keep rolling, keep rolling. Fast across the floor. You can see what they're doing back there, so you can see their footwork. They're side to side on the shuffle. When they get in place, they're stepping back into their stance. So they're not keeping their feet squared for the punch. Stepping into their stance, shuffle across. Two, two, pivot that feet, shuffle across. Pop. Zip, this is quick, this is quick. You have to push the pace. We do not half-ass anything here at peak. We don't half-ass anything in freaking life. Shh. Shh. Give a shit what's going on outside, you do not half-ass it. Pop, pop, light on your feet. Let's go this for 20 more seconds. Fast across the floor, shuffle it across. You're too, that's not where you were. Too far forward. Need to be able to see your feet. So you're shuffling side to side. And time. First combo. On the bag if you have it, or if you have something to punch, or if you need to go find someone in your house, or one of your neighbors to punch, just bring them on in and use them as your dummy, as your punching bag. These two are gonna be hitting the bag. I'll be showing you in the air. All we're doing is simple. It's a progressive one, two, three. Simple stuff. Just trying to get you to basics here. Get your body flowing, get your blood flowing, Get yourself moving. Just a simple one, two, three. So straight, left hook. They're gonna be doing it on the bag, but this is progressive. That means we're starting with a one, then a one, two, then one, two, three, set. Back to the one, set. One, two, reset. One, two, three. If you're not hitting a bag, if you're like me on the floor, first of all, your body temperature will be up. So we're gonna start stripping. We're gonna start stripping. Throw the dollar bills, the virtual dollar bills around as we start stripping. So keep going, you're doing a one, then a one, two, then a one, two, three. So that's a straight left, reset. Straight left, reset. Straight left, straight right, reset. Straight left, straight right, left hook, reset. Then back to just a one. So it's just a progressive one, two, three. Easy stuff, simple stuff. One, two, three. Progressively, starting with the one by itself. Going to the one, two. You can watch them on the bag there. Then all three, one, two, three. So start with one, two. One, two, three. If you're in the air like me, you better be moving around. You better be light on your feet all over the place, burning yourself out, running into shit, running through walls, running through obstacles, attack the fucking hill. Whatever that hill is in your life. One. One, two, one, two, three. Back to the top. Reset. One, one, two, one, two, three. Pop, Pop boom. One, two, three, one, two, three, one. One, two, one, two, three. So it's in slow motion a little bit. It's a one, straight left, reset. Then a straight left, straight right, reset. Straight left, straight right, left hook. Look at the hands. When I'm throwing that one, whatever hand's not punching is glued to the chin. When I throw that two, they're like two trains crossing on the track, bam. And this other one comes up, chin stays tucked. I'm tucked behind my chin behind the shoulder. I go to that three, boom. reset from the beginning. One, two. One, two, three. One, one, two. One, two, three. Light on your feet, reset. Bounce around, use your feet, use your space you have, move around. Pop, 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 pop. Bounce, move, flow, get your waist, your abs, your lats into it, your legs, bounce in your step. Full speed, full freaking energy. If you see me looking over here, because that's our Instagram crowd, Facebook is over here. So, one, one, two, one, two, three, progressively. 
Keep it moving. Watch them on the bag. If you have something to punch, punch it. Nothing like sinking those knuckles into some flesh, into a heavy bag. Let them fly. Let those hands fly. Turn the body. Pivot the feet on those twos and threes. But try to step back here without knocking this camera over. Pivot the feet. Turn the hips on those twos. Turn. You two are still working. Keep working. Keep those hands up. Time. We're going to get some leg, a leg set in. Get those arms a break. You're going to do a power squat. Back to your exercise spot. Just pop, pop, and drop. Pop, pop, and drop. So your feet are together. Bounce for two. Drop into a deep squat. Your hands are staying up in your freaking guard. Pop, pop, and drop. Drop low. Bounce, bounce. Drop wide. So you can see them. Their feet bounce together and drop into a deep full squat with the feet apart. As you can see them dropping down there. Hands stay in the guard the whole time. Not dropping to your chest, not dropping to your gut, not dropping to your freaking nuts. Up in your guard. Protecting the ugly mo. Pop, pop, drop. Pop, pop, drop low. Boom, boom, drop. Pop, pop, drop, get low. Both feet together with a bounce. Sit back on the hips and heels on that squat. Get low. Breathe it out. We're rolling. Starting to get the pace moving a little bit. Feet together for two. Down, out, wide for one. Time. We're going now to our second, our next combo. Next combo is going to be a four, five, six, but it's going to be progressive, just like the one, two, three. So you're going to go four. You're going to reset. Four, five. Reset. Four, five, six. So right hook is a four. Then right hook, left upper. Then right hook, left upper, right upper. Four, four, five, four, five, six. It's just a four, five, six progressive combo. Let's do it. You have something to punch? Punch away. Smash. Smash the damn bag. Bang it out. So we're on a four, four, five. Get your body into it every time, every punch. Make every punch count. It's every punch. Full speed, vicious, violent intentions. I don't care if you're punching the freaking air. Violence, vicious, intensity on every single freaking punch. No matter what your target is. No matter what you're punching, you go all out every time because that's just how you roll. Whatever you're doing is all out. Hook, hook, upper. Hook, upper, upper. Let them fly. Get those abs and waist into it. We're rolling. We're rolling. Four. Four, five. Four, five, six. Right hook. Right hook, left upper. Right hook, left upper, right upper. Let them fly. Let them fly. Come on. Full speed if you're punching the air. If you're punching the air, I need you to go faster. I need you to go stronger. You cannot just stand in place. You need to go full speed. Beat the freaking shit out of the air. Every punch. You will get work. You will sweat. You will get your technique down. You will burn calories. You will kill fat. And you will still feel freaking amazing. Keep rolling. If you don't have something to punch. If you end up liking the boxing and you don't have it at home, get yourself a little simple bag to hit at home. It's going to make a world of a difference, especially in times like this when you're unable to get out of the house. You're unable to make it a peak for your, for your workouts. We do live boxing sessions every single day, morning and night here at peak, online, on our members only site. So four, four, five. Boom, 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 and add the six. Done, time. So we're gonna go back to that power squat. We're just gonna add in a front kick. So we're gonna say, pop, pop, drop wide, come up, right kick, front. Then pop, pop, drop, as you come up, left front kick. Let's see it. Pop, pop, drop. Right front. Pop, pop, drop. Left front. This wire is tripping me up in here. So if I, you see me going at a weird angle, it's just to get away of this wire so I don't screw you up so we don't lose our connection. Pop, pop, drop. Right front. Pop, pop. Hands are in your guard. I'm going to come over there swinging next time. You better keep those hands up. Don't let me catch you off guard. Oh, yeah? Little shit is taunting me. This little kid is taunting me. Getting taunted by an eight-year-old. So hands are up, pop, pop, drop wide, 
right front kick, pop, pop, drop wide, left front kick as you come up, pop, pop, drop, one kick, left front, pop, pop, drop, pop, pop, drop, we're adding on to this next round, get that leg up there, bend the knee and extend, boom, drive it, get your hips into it, get some force off the ground to drive forward into that strike, into that kick, so watch what they're doing, bouncing with their feet together, Jumping out wide as they come up, boom, right front kick. Pop, pop, drop, come up, boom, left front kick. Right. I'm looking at here, it looks left. I'm calling off here. Right front kick, left front kick, keep moving. Because here it's reverse. Hands are up in the guard the whole time. Keep it right. Pop, drop, bam, pop, pop, drop, boom. Keep it going, keep it going, one more. Time. Next combo, right back to the bag or the air if you're with me. If you have a bag, go punch it. Our combo is three, two, one. We're going progressive. We're still sticking with the progressive theme. So you're on three, reset, three, two, reset, three, two, one. Left hook, left hook, straight right. You know the damn combo, start going. You don't got to watch me. You ain't going to burn calories. Listen, you're not going to burn calories just watching me. You're going to burn calories by busting your ass, by pushing the pace, going as fast as you possibly can, high intensity the entire time, not just going at your own, not just pacing yourself. Go at your own pace, but that better be a fast, hard, steady, strong pace. You cannot hold back. So we're on three, reset, three, two, reset, three, two, one. So left hook, add a straight right, add a straight left. Just coming over here for the Instagram group over here. Keep it rolling. The final combo is three, two, one. It's progressive. That means three, reset. Three, two, reset. Three, two, one. Bounce, rhythm, flow, bounce, move around, rhythm, flow. Let your body shift side to side. We're throwing those punches working your abs, your waist, your obliques. Turn into it. Shift your body weight. Pivot your feet, your entire body into all these strikes. That's the way you need to be thinking. Three. Three, two. Three, two, one. I let them fly. Watch these freaks on the bag. The way they're impacting with the hooks, the straights, and another straight. Three, two, and one is what they're driving with. All right, back to the exercise. Back here on the floor. Here, we're going two squat jumps, right knee. Two squat jumps, left knee. So we're here, literally in a squat for two. One, two, and right knee. Back up a little bit so you can see it from the side. Two squat jumps, two, and knee. Think, picture taking that target, bam, driving it into the knee. Taking your knee, putting it through the face or the chest or the gut or the nuts of your target. Nut shots will work. Two squat jumps. One thing my daddy taught me. He didn't teach me much, but one thing my dad taught me was the first one to fight dirty wins. If you need a kick to the nuts, do what you got to do. And boom, right knee. Two squat jumps. Boom, left knee. Go all out here. It's going to hold this mic so it doesn't rattle you around. Bam, right knee. Squat jump for two. Left knee, boom, get up there. Two squat jumps, sit back on the hips and heels. On those squat jumps, sit deep down, get some air. Get some air and boom, knee. Two, left knee, bang. Dig. Drive. Time. Who knows the next combo is going to be? Who's been following the trend? What? Six, five, four. Six, six, five, six, five, four. Damn, the kid nailed it. The kid nailed it. Six, five, four progressive. That means a six. A six, five. Six, five, four. He told me all three combos coming up. So it's six because he's been following the trend. Let this stuff start clicking into your brain and start making sense to you. So six, six, five. Then six, five, four. So six is your right upper. Right upper, left upper, six, five. Add in the right hook. Six, five, four. Six, 
If you're punching the air, I need you to punch full speed, full power while maintaining your balance without hyperextending your arms, throwing your shoulders out with control and balance. Right upper, right upper, left upper, right upper, left upper, right hook. Six, six, five, six, five, four, boom. Six, six, five, six, five, four. Who's there? Delandre. Delandre, I hope you're joining us. Hope you're beating the shit out of some air with us. Or the, or the heavy bag. Or the wall. Just put a bunch of holes in the wall. It's the end of the world anyway. Who cares? Right upper. Right upper, left upper. Right upper, left upper, right hook. Boom. Boom, boom. Boom, boom, boom. Six, six, five, six, five, four, progressive. Watch them on the bag, watch how they're flowing. Whatever hand's not punching is up at their chin, flowing into it. It's a right upper, right upper, left upper, right upper, left upper, right hook. Six, five, four, killing it, killing it. These are power punches. These are close range punches, power freaking punches. That's the way you need to think about it, power punches. Let's do it a couple more. Trying to keep up with your messages down there. Six, six, five, six, five, boom, four. Reset, hands up in between. Time. We're gonna go back to that power squat. We're gonna add that right front kick. We're gonna add a right knee right behind it. So you're at a power squat. If you can see my feet, if not, you'll see them behind me. So you're pop, pop, drop, come up, right kick, right knee. Right to power squat, pop, pop, drop, you have something to hit, fucking hit it. Hit it, kill it, attack it, destroy it. Seek and destroy your targets. That's what you need to be thinking. So Not holding back. Pop, pop, drop. Right front, right knee. Pop, pop, drop. Left front, left knee. Pop, pop, drop. Front kick. Push the pace, especially if you know you don't have a target. Push the damn pace, all out, full speed, every single set. Bring the fucking fire every second of every second is what you need to be thinking of. Approaching everything in life, not just your workouts, everything. You go out to get the mail, you go get the mail like a motherfucker. That's the way you need to think about things. Pop, pop, drop. Right front, right knee. Pop, pop, drop. Left front, left knee. Trying to keep up with me, boy? Are you kidding? I'm trying to keep up with you. You're gonna wear my ass out. So watch their technique for a second. Feet together for two pops. They drop into a wide, deep squat, come up. Right front, right knee. Pop, pop, drop. Left front, left knee. While the hands are staying up, protecting that ugly mug. Pop, pop, drop, kick, knee. Pop, pop, drop, hands stay up. <laughs> Drive it, keep it flowing. 20 more seconds, keep it rolling. 20 seconds. Finish it off, finish it off. Feet bounce together, they go apart. You drop down, attack it. And time, we're going back to our punches. We're gonna put all six together. One, two, three, four, five, six. Don't forget, this is Facebook, you're seeing shit opposite. So realize your one is your straight left, two is your straight right, three is your left hook, four is your right hook, five is your left upper, six is your right upper. We're gonna do it progressive. Same way we've been doing this stuff all day. So you should be on a one. Let's do it, we're up. You know how to do this, you don't need to wait for my instruction. So just follow them, I'll go slow, they're going full speed. Follow along if you need to. So we're on a one. one, two, one, two, three. Come over here for the Instagrams. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. So straight left, straight left, straight right. Straight left, straight right, left hook. Straight left, straight right, left hook, right hook. Straight left, straight right, left hook, right hook, left upper. Straight left, straight right, left hook, right hook, left upper, right upper. So that's a one. One, two, one, two, three. One, two, three, four. 
One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Progressive. Start back at the top with the one. Go at your own speed, your own pace. Get your technique down. Don't go any faster than perfect. Keep your technique. Pivot your feet. Turn your body into this a freaking tack. It's a message you can't see me on the Instagram page. I'm trying to go back and forth between these two. But you can see these freaks. They're doing it 10 times better than me anyway. So that's really what you need to see. I'm also mic'd up on the Facebook page. That's the one I gotta, I'm just kind of staying next to. So one, one, two, one, two, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Get your body into it. We're gonna go slow motion for this one, just so you can see the technique. One, snap it out. One, two. One, two, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's go slow technique for the group Instagram. One, one, two, one, two, three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right there, keep flowing, keep flowing. Adding a punch on every time. Progressive, progressively ass kicking. Progressively killing fat. Progressively burning calories. Progressively getting your ass off the couch. Project, the Corona Project. Operation Keep Fucking Moving. That's all you need to worry about, move. Just move. Couple more, couple more. Let's check out that te technique over there in the bag. They're hitting it, they're smashing it. Power punches. Whatever hand's not punching is up at their chin because they're gonna get cracked if they're not. Keep the guard. Shit, he's coming after me. I'm out of here. Time. Not yet. First, gotta go to a leg set. So now we're gonna hit, we're gonna come keep. Combining our st all this stuff together. We're gonna hit the power squat for one, right into two jump squats, right to a front right kick, right knee. I'll walk you through it. So we're going power squats. Stay right here and do it with me. Power squat for one, pop, pop, drop, right into two squat jumps. One, two, right front, right knee. Power squat, pop, pop, drop, two squat jumps. Whoosh, left, left knee. If you see me holding the weird stance, I'm just holding this wire so it doesn't. Trip us up, choke us up, knock you off. Let's get a straight on. You can see him behind me a little bit if you can see his feet and not mine. So we're going pop, pop, drop, two squat jump. Front right, front knee. Pop, pop, drop, two squat jumps, explode. Left front, left knee, drive it in there. Keep rotating through that. We just keep combining all these freaking pieces together. Power squat to two squat jumps. You can see Tyson there on the screen. A little too close for me, but it's pop, pop, drop, two squat jumps, right front, right knee. Power squat, drop, two squat jump, left front, left knee. Even if you have nothing to hit, even if you don't have a bag, you will still get tons of work. I'm outside, this shirt is soaked. It's only 50 something degrees outside. It's chilly out, I'm soaking wet, sweating, just from doing a fraction of what they're doing. They're working twice as hard as me more than twice as hard, and they're impacting the bag. You could still get crazy workout. You need zero equipment, not much space at all. As you can see, I'm right here, right in front of this camera with you. You don't need any space. You can get this shit done in an empty elevator. Let's keep rolling. Don't act like you need to stop to listen to me. You heard all this shit before. Pop, hop, drop, two squat jumps, front kick, three. Pop, pop, drop, two squat jump, left front kick, left knee, drive it. Keep it rolling. Front, knee, pop, pop, drop, two squat jump. Front kick, knee. Nice of you to join us. That means the set just started. What? The Russian just joined us. That means the set just started. Let's go. Pop, pop, drop, two squat jump. Right front, right knee. Pop, pop, keep rolling. 
two squat jump, left front, left knee, boom, boom, power, explode, explode, pop, drop, pop, pop, drop, two squat jumps, get up there, left front, left knee, damaging strikes, attack, time. What combo we got, Tyson? Mike's right here. What do you think? Six. Six, five, six, five, four, six, five, four, three, six, five, four, three, two, six, five, four, three, two, one. The kid nailed it. First shot. His brain is wired a little differently. Good thing he said it because I forgot what the damn combo was. Just kidding. So we're, com we're doing a six, six, five, four, three, two, one, progressive. So we'll walk you through it once. Let's go. You start. You don't need to, you don't need to walk you through shit. Just go. Six, six, five. Six, five, four. Six, five, four, three. Six, five, four, three, two. Six, five, four, three, two, one. So you're starting with that right uppercut, the six. Boom. Add in the left uppercut. Boom. Boom. Add in the right hook. Six, five, four. Add in the left hook. Six, five, four, three. Add in the straight right. Six, five, four, three, two. Add in the straight left. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Go at your own speed, go at your own pace, but push the damn pace. It's air, you're punching air. Just don't throw your shoulders out, don't hyperextend your elbows, and you're gonna be all good. Maintain your balance, bounce in your step, light on your feet, full speed, boom. Boom, boom. Full flow, full speed, you will get out of breath, you will get work done, you will burn calories, you will burn fat, you will kill fat, you will feel better. Keep it rolling, keep it rolling. We'll go through that combo again. It's six right upper. Six, five, that's a right upper, left upper. Six, five, four. Adding in the three. Six, five, four, three. Don't forget, Facebook shows shit backwards. So as I'm saying right, do it right. Don't do what you might think you're seeing. Six, five, four, three. Six, five, four, three, two. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Let them fly, let them fly, let those hands fly. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Progressive. Keep it moving. Keep those hands up. And time. What you gonna do next? Shake those arms out. Shake those arms out. We're not done. We're not done. It's just a lot of punching. We just beat the shit out of a lot of air. Broke a lot of bones in the air. Devastating, damaging strikes to the air. So what we're gonna do now is a run and punch. If you're on a bag, run and punch. You could just do it in the air. This means high knees, straight punches, full speed ahead. You're gonna see how they do it on the bag, and that's how you're gonna do it in the air. So right here, high knees, straight punches. You can see on Instagram, full speed. So from the side view, fully extend the arms. Fully extend, thighs come parallel to the floor. You're pumping this out. Those knees are up. Those thighs are parallel to the floor. Keep pumping it. Do not slow down. We got 30 more seconds over on Facebook. Don't back down now. Don't slow down. Don't stop. Bouncing your step. Instagram, don't back up. Don't slow down. Don't change your pace. Your heat knees are up. It's going to back up so you can see the knees. They're up here. Thighs are parallel. 10 seconds. Burn it out. Faster. Even faster. Even faster! High knees, straight punches, full speed. Time! Oh yeah, good set. All right, you're going to plank and punch. I'm gonna change this camera. Push up position, punch in the bag. Plank and punch, the bag. I'm just gonna angle this down so you can see them down there. Go, plank and punch. So from the push up position, you're right here. You could also do it in the air, just like I'm doing. Put your feet as close together as you can, but as far apart as you need to to keep your balance. Tyson's got his feet all the way together. The hardest way of doing it and falling over. But that's what you do. You take risks. You work it. You take a challenge. Guess what? You fall on your face. What happens? You get right back the hell up. Shh. 
alternating sides. Yes. Keep rolling. Your back is straight. So make sure you see the technique. Your hands are lined up straight underneath your shoulders. Yes, no excuses. No excuses. Brand that shit. Push-up position. Reach out and pop. You're not going slow. You're not going soft just because you, you, you're in a push-up position. You're still banging it. We're up on our feet. Back up on our feet for a jack and punch. So when our feet go apart, we punch. Pop, pop, pop. What are we waiting for? Special limitation? A smoke signal? So plat, jack and punch. Feet go apart while you impact the bag. Pop, pop. So you can see their feet are coming apart. Come back here for Instagram so you can see it. Feet come apart, pop, 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 pop. Now if you wanna make this workout even harder, when you're doing all this air stuff, if you don't have, hit the damn bag. If you don't have a bag to hit, you can hold little light dumbbells. Even one pound dumbbells, two pound dumbbells, three pound dumbbells, five pound dumbbells for this workout would be brutal. Your shoulders would be done, even just five pounds, I'm telling you. So don't even think about 10 pounds. It just won't work, you'll be slow and sluggish and you'll be like this and you'll kill your shoulders. Five pounds is max and you will destroy yourself. That'll be freaking hard. It's hard enough just with the air. So let's continue those jack punches. 30 seconds, feet apart, snap. Pick up the pace. Breathe, pop, 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 pop. 10 seconds, a little faster, pop. Feet go apart while you pop the bag. Snap it. And time. We're gonna go crunch and punch. I'm gonna angle you back down to see the freak shows on the floor. They're gonna punch up and hit the bag. I'm gonna punch up and hit in the air. So you sit up, you throw two punches. Yes, we're on the concrete. Yes, we don't give a damn. So it's crunch and punch. So you're just moving this wire out of the way. Crunch, two punches. Right back up, you're on concrete, it doesn't matter, it doesn't hurt, death hurts a lot more. Being out of shape hurts a lot more, being a failure hurts a lot more, being a loser hurts a lot more, being overweight, unhealthy and dying, death hurts a lot more than some concrete bashing on your back and maybe the back of your head, who cares? Every time you come up, one time go left, right. Next time you come up, go right, left, just to switch it up. Mix it up. I don't know if you can see us on Instagram, but we're sitting up, going two punches. Let me angle that Instagram down if possible because that's way up. Well, you can see you a little bit. There you go. So you can see we're doing a sit up. Let's go 30 more seconds. Sit up and two punches. Go left, right one time. Next time, go right, right, left. Left, right. 20 seconds, 20 seconds, we're rolling. How's that concrete feeling, boy? How's it feeling, boy? Good. Okay. Okay. <laughs> 10 seconds, finish it strong. Time. All right, as we've been doing, we do single sets of stuff, and then we combine shit together. So we're gonna combine those last four together. I will call the switch. It's run and punch, it's plank and punch. So we're gonna go through all of them with the run and punch. Then the plank and punch, shh, shh, to the jack and punch, shh, shh, to the crunch and punch, to sit up in two punches. I will just call the switch. So let's all start with run and punch. Let's go, we're running punching it. We're running punching it, go. High knees, straight punches. Coming over here on Instagram. Get those up there, get those knees up there. Thighs parallel to the floor. Get them up, get them up. Pump it, pump it, pump it, pump it, burning. Get those abs tight. Bouncing your step. Switch, plank and punch. Right away, we're going straight through. No break. Switch, jack and punch. Shh, 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 shh,
just gonna hold this. Bouncing around. Come on, Tice. Pick up the pace. Pop, hop, 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 hop. Boom, boom, there it is, time. Crunch and punch, right away, crunch and punch. Sit on your back, on your back, on your back. Sit up, and two punches, right away. Need to switch up that camera again to see you down there. Little freak show in the back, playing basketball. Sit up, two punches. Banging it, banging it. Just because you're doing a sit-up doesn't mean you're not throwing real punches. Come up and pop, pop. And time. We are gonna stretch it out. We just finished off that final burnout round. If you were pushing the pace the way you should be, you should be sweating. You should be out of breath. You should be soaked like we are. And they're, listen, they were working harder than me. I was trying to just coach you through most of this. So I was only doing some of it. They were working twice as hard as me. And I'm sweating, I'm out of breath. I'm getting results out of this. I feel my core just from all the punching, the turning. That's the only ab workout you need. It's the only ab set you need. If you're always keeping your abs tight, you're always working your abs, especially in these boxing workouts, kickboxing workouts, those kicks, those knees. This is core. This is the ultimate core. No other core needed. Then when it's fast and explosive and changing direction, you can just feel, bam, bam, just ripping. That's how you get flat abs. That's how you get strong abs. That's how you get functional freaking abs, is stuff like this, focusing on your technique, attacking it. So let's go to the same stretch as we did in the beginning, except we're gonna hold them now. So let's go over that shoulder stretch to start off. Pull the elbow straight across, and we're gonna hold it 15, 20 seconds. You can even hold it longer than that if you want to. Do what you gotta do. You know your body, you know how long you need to do it. I wanna remind you, if you did this workout, if you f did this workout on your own, first of all, you should be free feel freaking proud of yourself, because 99% of the people are just sitting at home feeling pissed off, depressed, complaining. Fling it open, stretch it. If you did do this workout, if you did it with us live, Take a picture of yourself right now. Give you, hold yourself accountable. Post it in the comments below here or just post it on your page. Tag me in it. Show me. Hold yourself accountable that you actually finished this workout. I want to see that you did it. If you didn't do it yet, when you do it on your own, when you follow along, fling it open. One more time on the left side. Back to that left side. Your shoulder's going to be a little tight here. Take a picture of yourself after you complete it. Any workout bonus that you do that's follow along, that's with us on your own, you need, I want you to take a picture of it. Also, don't forget, fling it open, other side. Check in on Facebook after every single session you do with us. Still checking in to Peak Physique Personal Training Bootcamp and Boxing in Nanuet. Still check in for each workout because we are still donating to charity. You check in for charity. The more that you check in, the more we donate each month. This month, it goes to Souls for Souls. I'm sure there's going to be a new charity coming up that has to do with Operation freaking Corona, the Corona Project. I'm sure it's gonna be, don't forget, it's the Corona Project, it's Operation Keep Fucking Moving. That's the way you need to think about it. Let's get those quads stretched. If you need to hold on to something, hold on to something because we want you to hold this for about 15, 20, 30 seconds. If you have to hold somewhere, hold somewhere, or if you have the balance, do it. You could also do it laying on the floor. We're just gonna do it standing here with you. You can see it, hop over to Instagram so you can see we're just here. Your body's upright, stretching it, holding that, switch over to the other side. The recovery process starts right now. The second you finish a workout, the recovery process starts. You gotta start refueling yourself, getting a pro your protein shake in, getting your quality protein source in, rehydrating yourself, thinking about recovering with your BCAAs, your glutamine. Think about boosting and replenishing your immune system. Think about immune system, not just when shit goes wrong and there's all kinds of nasty fucking viruses around. Think about your immune system all year long and you will rarely get sick. Let's go back to those quad stretches, the other side. Make sure you're holding it. Get a good stretch in the quad, in front of the hip. While you're breathing, start slowing your heart rate down. Get ready to recover, get ready to refuel, replenish. So this was just a pretty simple, basic boxing, cardio, get a little sweat going workout for you to follow along just to get you off your ass, to keep you moving while you're stuck in your home. Now we have, we do 
over three to four live videos per day, live training sessions per day on our private membership site. So if you need some help during these times, staying focused, your gym is shut down, guess what? Peak does not shut down. We do not slow down. We fucking charge forward. We attack the hills. We have obstacles in our way. We freaking attack them non-stop all the time. So some of these videos once a week at least is going to be a free video here just for the entire public to get on this on our, our public page. But if you need, want, need some regular coaching, some regular guidance, some regular motivation, some regular ass whooping, we have live workout training sessions going on several times per day, boot camp sessions, strength sessions, cardio sessions, group sessions, one-on-one -on -one private training, all from your home. We're, you're pretty much just bringing us into your home just like you are right now. And we will hook you up just because the world's coming to a fucking end doesn't mean you have to come to an end with your health and your nutrition and, and start slowing your metabolism down, start feeling bad for yourself, sitting at home, getting depressed, getting So keep moving, attack this stupid freaking virus thing, full speed, keep it safe, because you are fucking awesome. Tyson, want to finish off telling them anything? No excuses! Very, very normal child. I can't imagine where he gets it from. I will talk to you later. Let me know if you need help with anything. Put a comment below or send me a private message if you'd like to know about our, our membership site where there's live training going on as early as 5 a.m. all the way through the evening till 8 p.m. Sessions through all throughout the day, live training sessions, plus a membership resource site with tons of resources, recipes, cooking instructions, everything you need to know, warm-ups, tons of hundreds of exercise workout videos for you to follow along with and live videos every day. So just let me know if you need any help with anything. Put the comments below. I will talk to you later. You are fucking awesome. No excuses. No excuses. Thank what? you for watching.